After nearly a year in transit, NASA's experimental double asteroid redirection test, DART mission, which sought to answer many questions, had the spacecraft successfully collide with the dimorphous asteroid. Though NASA ground control has not yet received all of the data from the collision, they have confirmed that the DART impact probe has successfully intercepted the target asteroid. The asteroid dimorphous is about the size of an American football field, but space is vast and very dark and both the asteroid and the spaceship were flying at high speeds. To investigate the potential of defensive satellites as a way of protecting Earth against neighboring solar system bodies, NASA launched the DART mission in November 2021. Nearly 68 million miles from Earth, the DART impactor vehicle, about the size of a vending machine, intersected Dimorphos's course, killing him instantly. However, whether now or future versions of a planetary defense system packed with satellites are willing to go full Junebug versus Chrysler windshield against actual planet-killer asteroids remains to be seen. Dimorphos is the smaller of two gravitationally entangled asteroids. Its parent rock is almost five times as huge. However, both are dwarfed by the space rock that crashed into Earth 66 million years ago, wiping out 75% of multicellular life on the planet and carving out the Gulf of Mexico. The DART crew will spend days sifting through the information collected by the impactor and the cameras sent out before the spacecraft makes its final approach. A reduction in Dimorphos's orbital route around Didymus by 10 minutes would be ideal, but the crew will celebrate any modification of at least 73 seconds as a triumph. Since the moonlet takes about 12 hours to complete a round around Didymus, the scientists will need to monitor Dimorphos's orbit for half a day to validate their success. That's it for today, and as always, make sure to like, subscribe, and check our website at www.techwiki.co. Thanks for watching.